Hello, my name is Jackie Weta King, and I'm the Communications and Marketing Manager with Trees Forever, and I am here today with Aaron Brewer. Hello. Aaron is one of our experts on SAF who's going to tell us a little bit more about invasive species. That's right. We have a field day coming up. What has wandered into Backbone, Backbone State Park? It's on September 20th. So we're going to give you a little briefing on what you might see at that workshop. Specifically, we're going to talk about Oriental Bittersweet, which is a non-native invasive plant. It's, it is a vine, so it sort of starts off as a little spindly little vine there, and it can grow about the size of your tree there. It, it, as it searches for sunlight and girdles the tree like a boa constrictor, really killing off your tree. And you can see how much, how dense it is on the very, very top of the canopy. It's, um, it's hard to even see sunlight through all of those vines. And it's, it, they can actually get so heavy that they topple over. Yeah, it's very detrimental to your woodlands. So there is a native bittersweet, American bittersweet, and it looks pretty similar. They kind of have oval leaves, but the way to distinguish the two is that the Oriental bittersweet will have berries all the way up the vine, and the American bittersweet just has on the terminal bud. So as it has many, many berries, the birds will eat that and then spread those throughout our woodland. So that's a big way that it's, it spreads through here. So what other plants are we seeing here on the woodland floor? Because this isn't all just oriental bittersweet, but no, there's a lot of it. Unfortunately, yes, there is. Unfortunately, this area has quite a few invasive species. This is a honeysuckle plant here, just a little seedling. Um, more honeysuckle here. This is actually multiflora rose. Other invasive plants. So if you panned through here, you, you really can't see through or walk through. So this is a, a very unhealthy woodland right here. And if there's these plants and there's not room for the native plants that are so beneficial, the pollinators and all the other many benefits that we that we want from our woodlands. Right? Absolutely. Our invasive plants are really good at reproducing themselves and really choking out the forest floor, running that sunlight from getting those natives to grow. So they're really out competing our, our native plants. Um, so at Backbone, Backbone is a great place to actually go see for yourself what what methods work best. Yeah, Can you talk a little it's bit? the oldest state park in Iowa. Yeah, so they have done some a couple of test plots at Backbone for Oriental Bittersweet. One is through prescribed fire and the other one is through chemical applications. So they're going to kind of unveil uh, the results of their test plot, what works best for them. Um, quick method is to do, you could do some hand pulling, and it sort of has an orange root system to it, the Oriental Bittersweet. Um, so yeah, many, many invasive plants in our Iowa woodlands. Uh, we really want to educate people. U.S. Forest Service identified Iowa as the number one state with non-native plants, so it's very detrimental to, to our economy even. So uh, we really want to teach you about that. So September 20th, go to our website to register, www.treesforever.org. We hope to see you in September.